Hello, Leo. Thank you for joining me for your weekly forecast for week commencing the 23rd of October. The last two weeks have seen a growing influence in the parts of your horoscope to do with the foundations of your existence. This is very much to do with where you live, who you live with and how, and also your emotional responses, how things feel. Also family matters are going to take on much greater prominence for you. Now the Sun moves into this sector on Monday, joining with Jupiter and Mercury. If you remember last week those two linked together for three days. This may have seen you think about ways that you could be more entrepreneurial uh, from the comforts of your home or even make some physical changes. But the Sun moving into this area is the very heart of your being. But its combination with Jupiter is potentially one of the most fortunate of all planetary aspects or connections. It can make us feel better about ourselves. So there could be some news or development this week which really cheers you, gives you a sense of uplift in some way. If you're looking for a greater sense of meaning in your life, you could also gain some knowledge which helps you to understand your deeper motivations and perhaps a greater understanding of the people that you're close to as well. Now it is true that Mars, the planet of passion, continues in the sign of Libra, but that's angling up brilliantly with the Sun and Jupiter too. So don't be surprised if your home is the hub of some kind of gathering or meeting, or you're the driving force around some kind of reunion or gathering. But with Mercury also forging a very subtle but potent link to Neptune, it could be that you're thinking about some more psychological, deeper issues, and you can make some wonderful connections or have some very meaningful conversations. It's possible you could help someone who's less fortunate or use your initiative to do something which is for the greater good. However, there is a quarter moon by the end of this week, and someone around you on Friday onwards could be a little bit out of sorts. This person may be someone who ordinarily you understand well. Perhaps they just seem out of sync with some of the needs and sensitivities that you're developing at this time. As I said last week, the last few months has been a time of great possibility for you to, ass to assert your individuality. But now I think you're wanting to have a bit of a pause and just understand what it all means. So there may be some times when you do want to just... Uh, have a little bit more peace and quiet and tranquility, perhaps some walks in nature. Just be with the people or have some time on your own, which gives you the tranquility to consider some of the major issues of life. It's been a real pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now. Hello, thank you so much for watching my video. I'd love you to join me at my Horoscope Ace app. You can find this at www.horoscope-ace.com. You can use it through Android, iOS, Apple or Facebook. Check out your Ascendant or your Moon site or download your free birth chart. There's all your favourite videos, plus there are daily, weekly, monthly and yearly horoscopes for general, love Chinese and Indian astrology. If your passion is tarot, there's my brilliant three card money or love tarot readings too. And it's all there at www.horoscope-ace.com. Thank you.